Okay, for many people that have visited my website already and believe that $60 is too good to be true to have your Wii modified, well, I'm here to prove that for $60, this is what you get. This is the original Pac-Man game from Atari 2600 and it came out in 1981, as you can see. And it plays flawlessly, along with all these 772 other... Um, Atari 2600 games. Go to the emulators page, we'll put another video up that shows off the emulators a bit more, but right now we're going to show you the really good stuff. So, you get this homebrew channel installed on your Wii that comes with these programs. It comes with a Wii Explorer, an N64 emulator, a Game Boy emulator, a Super Nintendo emulator, a Genesis emulator, and a regular Nintendo emulator. And there's also a homebrew browser where you can add games for free. But the really good part is the configurable USB loader program. Now, I would recommend that you get a 500 gigabyte USB hard drive. The games right now take about 400 gigabytes of space. But there might be some games that we don't have that you might want and all you have to do is open this program put the game in your drive and press the plus key and it'll copy it straight to the hard drive so here's all the games you get there's a little bit over 200 of them and as of now I'd say 97 percent of them all work we haven't gone through and tested them all but over 95 percent of them definitely work so I can click any game, the Pinball Hall of Fame, just press A, and there you go. So, like I said, it's only 60 bucks. If you don't have a hard drive, um, we don't sell them, I suggest you go buy one. I seen one at Best Buy on Black Friday, it was 750 gigabytes, and it was only $60. As you can see, this game works flawlessly. So, at this point, we're going to end this video by showing you the Wii MC program. We'll go back to the main menu. As you can see, you'll have this homebrew channel when you get your Wii back from us. It takes about six hours to transfer all the files, but it only takes about an hour and a half to do the whole mod. We don't open your Wii, we don't solder anything in, nothing like that. It's all software based, so... Anyways, we'll go to the Wii MC Media Player. What this allows you to do is play DVDs, DivX videos, MP3s, and even YouTube videos. And uh, if you have an FTP server, you can use that. If you're not familiar with what an FTP server is, then just Google it. Alright, and as you can see, there's a movie abduction that is saved on my other computer. And... Well, I watched it last night, so, but anyways, you can fast forward, rewind, watch any movie you want to download. And you can also play it from the hard drive. As you can see, if I go up to the top, I can view all the files on my USB hard drive, and there's uh, some movies in there as well. So, uh, anyways, we'll show you the YouTube part of it. Here's uh, the Shoutcast media player where you can listen to thousands of online radio stations. Very cool. Uh, it can also go up a level. It'll s continue playing as you're doing your search or whatever. See, I can go to YouTube search and we can type in like Mac Dre. Let's try that. You do have to have your um, we connected the Wi-Fi, of course, for this to work. 
but yeah, you can see I can click any one of these and it'll play back instantly. Very fast loading, um, very cool program. So yes, yeah, so that's included for the $60. There's no hidden fees. If your uh, CD-ROM drive is broken, we can modify it anyway, but we cannot fix the DVD drive yet as of now. Um, you can also listen to MP3 files. As you can see, there's some MP3s, and I press them, and they play back instantaneously. So that's the end of our video. Please give me a call at my number is 209-505-7690. Or you can send me a message on the contacts us form of the page. Thank you very much for viewing this video.